<laughs> Here we are. <laughs> Come on. Back at the Sheraton <laughs> on the Park for another overnight stay. And so we thought, you know what? We'll show you what we, what you can do in your room. <laughs> now, seriously, this is not a dirty video. This is what exercise you can do in a very small <laughs> space in your room while you're staying at the hotel. If you're too embarrassed to go up to the gym or you're just too lazy, you can do um, a Or you just exercise. want to stay in your room. <laughs> That's right. So we're going to do a really quick little workout for you. Okay, so see you in a minute. Hey, Con, nice toes. Yeah, I know. You've got well, actually very good feet. I know, I've got beautiful feet. You have, you have. And, so, and you have a foot fetish, don't you, honey? <laughs> Not really, no. Listen, just while I'm putting my shoes on, I just wanted to let you know that what we're going to do today is a burpee countdown, right? Countdown and lift off, right? So what's going to happen is we're going to do six burpees. You're going to do six. I'm going to do six. Then five, five, four, four, three, three, two, two, one, one. Oh, my God. And then God. back up again. Two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five. And six six. So I'm gonna do a full burpee with the jump, you're gonna do a half burpee with the jump, and we're gonna start at six reps and work all the way down to one and then back up to six. It's a really fast uh, workout and um, you can do it anywhere, including a hotel room. So let's get started. Okay, Nick, ready? Let's go. Six. Go kick back, kick forward, jump up, let's go. Up, that's it. Come, this is your hotel room workout. Let's go. You've got to drop that bum when you drop. Come on, come on, Nick, let's go. Kick back. That's it, kick forward, jump up. How many done, Nick? Three. Yeah, I don't want to stool you out of any extras. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Come on, Nick, faster. How many is that? Five. Last one, right? Yeah. My turn. <gasps> okay, come on, let's go. <laughs> Two. Come on, faster! Four. Five, you're next! <laughs> Let's go! Five, five, come on! Nick, you look at the camera when I'm doing it. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Four! Last one. Let's go. Five. One. Let's go. How many to go? This is my fourth one. Last one. <laughs> Your turn. Come on. That's one. Let's go. Okay. One more. Okay, Nick. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, we love punishment, don't we? <laughs> That's four. That's it, one. Fast, Nick, fast. Come on. Fast, Nick, fast. Last one. <laughs> okay, hit it. One. Two. Three. Woohoo! Three. Three. Okay, two. Let's go fast. One. Let's go. Two reps. Good. One, Nick. Come on, one, one. Come on. Fix your hair later. Good. <laughs> one. One. one, Nick. Two. Let's go. Quickly. Come on. One. One more. <laughs> come on. Okay, my turn. Hey. Come on. How many? Two, two, two. Go. Fast Nick, down. So kick, kick back and then forward straight away. Okay. Good. One more. 
That's it. Good. Three burpees. One. Almost there. Two. Three. Go. Let's go, come on. It's a zillion things we could do in this hotel room. But oh no, you decided to do burpees. Come on, Nick, kick back. Come on, come on. Three. Because you'll be tired after this, you'll be able to move. That's good. Go, okay, kick, come on. Kick, come on, kick forward. Let's go, Nick. Time is money, let's go. Jump, come on. Jump, that's it. Stop. Talking, let's wait. go. Come on, come on. Very energetic. Oh, excellent. <laughs> Wonder what else we could do for a couple of hours. <laughs> Can you get there? Come on, fight. Camera's on, waiting for you. Let's go. That's it. That's one. Ready, one more set. Let's go. Okay, all these people are knocking on the door now, wondering what we're doing. All the banging. Let's go. Three. Come push, Nick, push. Two more. Stop making me laugh. That's it. Kick. Go fast. Come on. Last one. Last one. Last one. Let's go. Kick. Then you got one more set to go. Well done. Five burpees. Show off. <laughs> Two more. That's it. Woo, last one! I'm just giving you more rest, honey. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Come in. Okay. Last set. Last Nick, let's go. Last set, come on, Nick, faster, let's go. Finish it off. That's three, come on. So kick back and forward straight away. So back and forward, and forward, and forward. Come on, here's four. Come on, finish up. Push me, this is the time to push. Last one. Come on, push. Excellent. Oh. You're hot. Cool, halfway, three more, come on. Last one, you One more. Yes. Yes. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> we certainly did. Keep going. Anyway, guys, when you're staying away, people go, oh, but there wasn't a gym, there wasn't a this and that. You can be on a ship, in, you know, in the cabin there, you could be like, staying in a nice hotel. You know, take a few extra minutes before you go out and have that beautiful dinner. Take a few extra minutes, do a couple of burpees, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> look into the lens, honey. Look into the lens. Okay. Look into people's eyes. All right. Sorry. We're looking, I'm looking at the camera. <laughs> the, the, the <laughs> that's, that's what All happens right. when you really do the All burpees. Right. Okay. So, what we've got to tell you is, um, Nikki, stop kicking your leg. It's moving the camera. Okay. All right. So, um, that didn't take long, did it? No. Didn't take that long. I don't know. A it's few minutes. Like, well, few minutes. I tell you what. If you can do that in six minutes. Uh, with, with two people back to back, at, that's actually a fast time, right? So what we did was six reps of burpees uh, each, and then um, we alternated between each other until we got to one rep, and then we counted all the way back up. That's right. Um, we're <laughs> staying in town, and we just did a workout in the room. Okay, so anyone can do it, including you. So we're, that's right. and we were up at um, the executive level before, well, executive level, wasn't it? Yes. And they had they were you know having afternoon us, tea. Afternoon tea. It was great. <laughs> Didn't agree with you. And then we said, <laughs> you know, before we go out, why don't we just do our, our, our workout today and we can do it, you know, um, the other one in the morning, of course. <laughs> That's right. So, all right, so um, what else would you like to say to everyone? I'd like to say thanks for watching. 
Um, we're looking forward to a really good night. <laughs> we're going to go dinner. Where to? Karaoke. Spice Temple. Spice Temple. Again, I know. We love it there. With 20 people. <laughs> yeah, with 20 people. And after they've had a few drinks, then we're going to go to karaoke <laughs> and find out who the real singers are in the group. And then we might come back and... Maybe have a few drinks and nibblies at the piano Yeah, bar. and so to all those people who are coming with us tonight to karaoke, we did an actual workout, not the sort of workout that you guys think of, <laughs> a real workout before dinner. Okay? That's right, that's right. Uh, so now we're going to go for a nice swim and steam room or sauna. Yeah. So it's a hard life. Someone's got to do it. All right, so, <laughs> so all the best, guys. See you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> Ron, honey. Morning, everybody. It's Sunday morning. Now, last night we had a great night out. And uh, this morning we just went for a bit of a walk and we're in Hyde Park, so we thought we'd have a little bit of a chat about last night and how it went. Um, Connor and I feel fantastic, but we just thought we'd have a general little chat about what people do when they go out at night and the consequences of that. <laughs> for us it's great because we feel fantastic, but uh, we thought we'd have a little bit of a chat about you know, what people do when they go out, you know, how they make their uh, night fun, and is it really necessary? So. We'll come and have a sit down and we'll have a chat. Okay, welcome back. Look, um, last night we had our night out and w what we tend to do is this. We tend to do about a five and a half day week where we train, we eat right, uh, we have a really good positive attitude towards life, etc. And then on the weekend, from about Saturday uh, lunchtime to Sunday night, we have no rules, right? Well, that's right. Yeah, <laughs> but in that day and a half, we don't ever do it either. And when it's you're sensible. healthy, yeah. Well, when you're healthy, you can you just your brain releases hormones into your body called endorphins, and you feel good, you feel strong. You can have a really mad time, and you don't need other substances like alcohol or anything to actually do it, right? That's right. So I just wanted, I think it's a good time to actually just get people to do a basic check of their body. So, for example, if you if you wake up in the morning and you're tired something didn't happen the night before, right? That's right. Yeah, That's like, right. You, like you haven't rested. You slept six hours, eight hours, whatever it is, your body should feel fine. If you eat, and after you eat, you, you feel lethargic or, you know, you just your energy drops. There's yeah. something wrong there, right? Like your pancreas releases hormones to do a few basic functions. We won't get into it, but basically your body maintains homeostasis, which is another word for balance. And, if, and when your body's in great balance, Everything feels good and nothing has a cost to it that should affect you in day-to-day -day life, right? So this is the morning after of, uh, of our night and we, we partied and had fun and all that sort of stuff, but we did everything in balance. In balance, you? yeah, and we yeah. Had, we've only had six hours sleep, but <laughs> we got up this morning, felt fantastic, had our breakfast, went for a walk. It's all good, but you know, have you ever heard that expression like high on life? Yeah. Yeah, if you do the right things by your body, guess what? So start listening to your body. <laughs> if, 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 you're, if there are indications of tiredness or, what's another one? You know, bulging eyes, like dark rings around your eyes when you're, you know, after a weekend. If you've had alcohol on the Saturday night and you need alcohol just to get into the mood, mm -hmm. something's missing, okay? That's I'm right. not saying you shouldn't have alcohol, but what we're saying is that if you need it to get into the mood, some people, you'll find just can't get into a zone without alcohol. And then, you know, they have a great night and then the morning after, they're dead. They like last night, <laughs> we, we finished up very early this morning, I should say. And as I went to the bar to pay our bill for the bits that we had, there was a, uh, the bar was closed, of course, right? Because it's like two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> but this guy turned up and he, he tried to get another drink, right? But he was gone. He was uh, off his <laughs> dial, right? And he really didn't need one. He was going to go go back to his room, obviously, and pass out. <laughs> yeah, but why would you need another shot just before going to bed? You know, that's the interesting thing. Yeah. Anyway, is there anything else uh, you'd like to recap on? Oh, I just want to say that, you know, um, enjoy your life, have a good time, share it with friends, go out and have fun. Life's too short. We had a ball, um, but everything in moderation. So you can still have a beautiful meal, you can have some wine, but everything in moderation and life will be good. That's right. So I just like to say we exercise to make to keep our body healthy, okay? And the trick is uh, we eat right to keep our body healthy as well. And we have a positive attitude to life to keep our body healthy because stresses come in all forms not just physical, they're also emotional, okay? So um, all the things that we do are there to maintain balance, right? Now you'll know it 
all I ask you to do is you look, you look into that mirror, right? And when you look into that mirror, what do you see, right? If the morning after you, you see something you prefer not to see, maybe you've done something wrong, okay? So, um, anyway, uh, that, that's going to conclude uh, uh, this uh, video. Um, we're probably going to do a, a, a bit of a tour of Sydney now. You can hear, probably hear in the background the, the bells going. That's for Nikki because Nikki was actually named a saint today. This is Australia's now, first I think saint. It's, uh, Mary McKillop. <laughs> so the bells are ringing in the um, St Mary's Cathedral and the other churches here. So it's absolutely beautiful. All right, all the best, guys. Bye. Bye.